on the news station. This is 7 News at 5. You ever feel like you're eating all the right foods but just aren't getting the results you want? Many, many times, Craig. Yes, the right food's like a candy bar, not really. Well, maybe you're eating all the wrong foods for your particular body. Seven's uh, Richard Lemus, rather, shows us a new test that'll pinpoint those forbidden fruit foods. I think you have food allergies. With a food allergy, oh, your body oh. lets you know which trigger food you better avoid. But there are many foods that we don't know about that are also hurting our bodies. Many people are eating foods they're intolerant to and they have no idea. Food intolerances are foods our bodies just don't digest well. Eating those foods can cause fatigue, migraines, and intestinal problems. Even worse, it could be the one thing that's keeping you from getting to your goal weight. Food intolerance is the number one reason why people can't lose weight. When you eat foods that you're intolerant to, you, are, you will gain weight because your absorption of nutrients will be deficient. You will retain water. To detect those forbidden foods, the Miami Institute of Age Management and Intervention is offering the ALCAT test. It's a blood test that detects 150 food sensitivities based on how your cells react when exposed to different foods. We actually put the blood into these cassettes that have different antigens or different foods. If someone's reactive to a number of those, what we do is we recommend they remove them from their diet. And in many cases, their, their symptoms improve almost immediately. Okay, so what we're going to do today is a test for intolerance. Alexa Malzone took the test after a healthy diet and exercise just wouldn't do the trick. I was at a point where I said, you know, why aren't I getting the results that I feel like I should be getting? While she was eating healthy foods, the test showed they were all the wrong foods for her body. I realized that 80% of the foods that I was eating every day that I thought were great for me were bad for me. She now passes on things like bananas and instead has peaches. And as she drops other intolerable foods from her diet, she's seen great results. I've been able to lose some body fat. I've probably dropped about five to eight pounds. So that really tells me that my body is really getting what it needs now. Richard Lemus, 7 News.